welcome to episode 64 of the Youth Squad Legends series with Stockport County. I have literally just loaded up FIFA and I can see that it, it's starting to break already. Fantastic. I don't really think that's where the symbols are supposed to go, Chief. Hell yeah, what a flawless game. Now, I know some of you guys might be saying, Chris, it was a little bit too easy last episode. So I spent five hours yesterday sorting out the sliders and i tell you something for the last couple of months i've completely forgot my camera could do this so you know what uh, uh. hey you got me yet yeah, the sliders should be a lot better today posh cutsy hello there posh Katsy here this board object was submitted by roma united thank you ever so much Mikel conquo decided to grace the team with his presence they spent most of the time binge watching her good town youth squad legends now the team want to play constant pressure please play constant pressure all the way through this episode Toodles! yes press oh my goodness that is gonna be a nightmare hang on i've realized that the camera is not in the right position there it is uh, yeah a ton of rotation needed in this episode it's stockport against everton right someone has suggested at the end of this series for me to create a compilation of the funniest bits in this series so it's nice and digestible for the people that couldn't really keep up with it all for the folks that want to look back at this series fondly they'll have that video at the end that can quickly remind them of the beauty of Stockport. I think it's quite a good idea, to be honest. Everton's still managed by Frank Lampard, everyone. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, yep. That really successful manager. Mm -hmm. Let's see how these sliders stack up then. Dolan wins the ball. Oh, God, our stamina's gonna be horrific. Think about the stamina, boys. Okafor, no chance. Sanders all locked him up. Soto with the toe poke. Jang Sung Chan, calm and collected. Tolan wants Bell Bell to move, but he ain't making the run. Creato, let's calm it down. I think possession will be our best friend here because that will mean that we don't need to press as much. I'm actually scared of losing the ball. I mean, we got to get into this box somehow. Oh, and now we've lost it. Well, so long, stamina. Uh, no, that's mine. Riley Sanders from out of nowhere over the bar. Oh, hello. Hello. Is that our free kick? Mmm, it's a long way out. I'm still gonna bring Duda in for laugh. Sorry, Sanders. He started this uh, game off well, but he knows the rules and so do I. Bang! Oh, that's massive. Oh, that's over. Oh, that's gone. Honestly, why is it like that? Go on, Duda. Let's have it, lad. Oh, no. Bustamante's not getting it. Big chance for Everton. And they have scored to make it 1-0 to the away side. There you go. Sliders are working. No problem, lads. I had it sorted from the very beginning. I think that's exactly what we deserve for our very tentative start. We need to get up the field and just don't be scared of losing the ball. This is a press. Oh, brilliant press. That is magnificent. Oh, Mikel Oconquo would be delighted. Bang it. Yeah! Socrates, me baby! Philosophize me! Whoa! Lovely fake shot to get into the area. 19 minutes gone, both teams have scored. Jang Sung Chan steamrolling through ball! Ellis! Great save! Dudo just about getting up to speed. Phenomenal athleticism. Oh, they stepped up. Andre Belbel is definitely off. <laughs> that was absolutely vile. I just had tuna and mayonnaise for lunch. It's uh, not brilliant having a recycled whip. Oh! Ah! Lopez! What are you doing, Chief? Everton are back in the lead after a harrowing mistake by the goalkeeper. The worst one that we've seen this season. Bustamante tried to get the ball. Looked like he was impeded. Creato is now out of position. Help me. Bustamante, get there. Close down the angles. We love closing down angles, don't we? It's a lovely attempt on the volley. What's Coit Cook talking about? Get me on the pitch! No, not yet. Yeah, no matter what, there's always going to be that weakness on the wings. The AI just don't know how to defend it. Cutting inside. Oh, that's a beautiful back heel. Ellis has got to finish. Ellis does not finish. It's right at the goalkeeper. And that is the increased shot error coming into play. Now at 80. I've had to put the shot error at 80. I'm just going to finish finishing. Okafor! Switch. Great save, Lopez. Oh, no. These players. These players have never felt tiredness like this. Bustamante put Slash. in a slide tackle. And it went straight back to the opposition. Lopez is certainly making up for the mistake 
they had earlier in the game. Lovely turn by Socrates Alves. I mean, they're going to pass that across. That That's just a goal, isn't it? Shambolic. We're knackered. Absolutely knackered. Start of the second half. Players can't really move the leg. Go on, Pegararo. I saw a slight gap there. Socrates is the only one that looks like he's holding up. Oh, brilliant. It's Socrates. It's absolutely genius from the lad. He's fantastic today. Oh, oh Oscar Gill. <laughs> Brilliant stop by Duda. Suggested substitutions are all about strikers, but honestly, I think we need more defensive coverage. Look at Bustamante, man. Cabasau's gonna have to play center back. Andre Belbel moving on as well for Pitska as your central midfielder. Goodness me. Let's have Miranda in for Pegararo, I guess. Constant pressure is not the one. <laughs> I got the ball. Referee. Ooh, he could have got sent off there. Here's my hot take in football. They only went to five substitutions per game to help out those teams that do constantly press all the time. And maybe there's a bit of fixture congestion as well. Because of the good advertisement that this makes on the game, I think they are trying to benefit those that uh, put a lot more effort into. And you know what? I can't really blame Smash. them. Good save, Lopez. I'd much rather see a team run for it and work for it than the uh, Pep Guardiola system of holding it for 80% of the game. Oh! And boring the opponents to sleep. For us to make this work, we are going to have to lead early and then just try and hold on. If it wasn't for Lopez... That scoreline could have read about six for Everton. So in my mind, his uh, mistake early on in the game is forgiven. Get in the ice baths, lads, because we're going to do that over again in seven days' time. Is it more than seven days? Looks like it. I think we have hit some kind of international break. We're switching it on the wings to Joshua Poli and Juicy John. Everybody's fit, thankfully. West Ham against Stockport. Now, that is pretty harsh on Socrates Alves, who was easily our best player last game. Ah, yes, bubbles. Why can't we have more stuff like this added to FIFA? Soto was on a little mission there. Leaves Bustamante defending three people. Loco, what's, a, what's that? What is that? Ugh. Mate, we're getting hounded. Lovely stop, Sanders. Come on, head up, boys. It's not game over just yet. Come on, Soto. Come on. It's not having a great 10 minutes here to open it up. Buster Mante with a header. Get a bit of calmness here. Juicy John. Ellis into Pegararo. John's onside. And we are into the box. Oh, the keeper has decided to head it out. Soto into the box again. Pegararo is going to drop to Pegararo. And of course, we got time finishing on. These lads have just not been built to constantly press. These are big bruising players for the most part. It's Joshua Poli. Little cut inside. Still unstoppable because the AI don't have a clue how to stop it. Joshua Poli. 1-1. One, one. Yeah, keep going, Joshua. Skips past the challenge. Who does this Poli fellow think he is? Get on it, Sanders. Oh. Tell you what, Sanders is so quick. Covers the Slash. ground really well. Well played, Lopez. We need this next goal. Brilliant by Dada Bustamante. Oh, not so brilliant by Dada Bustamante. What is going on, lads? Oh. We're lucky. Very, very lucky. There's players out there that are already starting to tire. It's 32 minutes into the game. Mikel Okonkwo. We deserve answers. His influence on the English game is just so profound. He comes in and immediately a team that can't constantly press think that they can constantly press just because a Nigerian shouted press at them a couple of times. We haven't seen much finishing off these strikers yet. That's a good ball. Pegararo's onside. Flag's not going up. We are leading. This is what we needed. So come on, Pegararo. Stop Bustaliano. We go wild, wild, wild. Big winners. Oh, Sanders, you absolute monster. See, Sanders is the player that could absolutely constantly press in the system. Joshua Poli is getting some double man coverage out on that side. Squish. We didn't get locked onto that ball properly and had to rely on the keeper making a big save. Let's get into half-time here. Keeper's coming out a bit. I've got a bit of a headache from shouting so much. I never thought that we'd have to rely upon Cabasau to be a sensor bike, but we're having a couple of changes at half-time. We're spreading the pain. Gives Papitska a lot more time to gel into the side. 
Miranda as well. He deserves more game time. He's getting more game time. Joshua Poli getting replaced by Kite Cook. That's our five substitutions done in 45 minutes. Oh, the bubbles are back. It's not so joyous now you're losing, is it? Dude has got to be careful. The pass will be coming across. I mean, you've got to stop that, dude. It was pretty obvious, man. That is certainly not what we wanted. At the start of the second half, sort yourself out. Where's Soto gone? Where's Soto gone in all of this? We just don't have enough men to defend it. No, no, no. no. I was not in control at all there. It's on its way to Cook Aldinho. You see the shirt pull referee. Where is it? Please don't be offside. Miranda, get it in. No. Pipitska. Winners. Oh, Pegararo. Mate, what a season he's having. I always knew he could be something special for us. I always saw that potential. No, don't pass it across again. Stop passing it across. You are not a 13-year-old online. You are the AI on FIFA. Shoot the ball sometimes on an angle. Papitska's had an influence on this game. Puts the ball in. Can't find Cook Aldinho. This will be Cabasau from the back. Cook Aldinho into Jang Sung Chan. Yeah! Jang Sung Chan. Move, lads, move. Jesus. Jesus. What a tackle, dude, though. First goal in the Premier League for Jang Sung Chan. Congratulations to him. And we got a man over. He's Juicy John on side. Yes, he is. Game is not sealed there. I'm making very, very strange noises. Cabasau had to intercept that. No, what is going on? Keeper, you've got to what? make it. Oh. Welcome to Yuko Ike's Haiku Chronicles with your host, Yuko Ike. Couldn't think of one. My brain needs a break. Thank you. Just one episode. I'm begging you to get back, wing back. I'm begging you. Massive opportunity for West Ham to level it all up. A back Space. kill. It's keeper's save. It's a keeper's save right at the end. And talking about keepers, their number one is up. West Ham going all for it. But Lopez catches it. And we have the win. Oh. Oh. Well done, lads. Come on, let's do that again. Back into ice baths. I should change my name by Depot, man. Not be called Curtis anymore. Just be called Slider Goat. You shall refer to me as Slider Goat. Creato, after a week of rest, is looking like that. Stockport against Leeds United. Well, I tell you what, this episode has been an absolute riot. So much so that it's given me a pounding headache. But it's okay, because I got paracetamol. It's Welly Steinbeck. Every time I see him, he looks a bit shorter. Andre Belbel with the cuts inside. Hey! Andre Belbel! Ding, ding! Maybe his first goal? Soaking in every single second of the glorious moment. That looks like it's a free kick. Is it even worth bringing Duda on at this stage? It's such a good free kick. I know who's gonna take it. You're right, Lopez. Watch this. You're right. Oh. You know what? It's not actually that bad. They could literally just shoot right now and score, but they decided to be great sports and put the goalkeeper back into the net. Cheers, lads. Oh, oh my God. Oh my God. We're so slow. Keeper. Squish. Lovely save. Steinbeck didn't really have an angle to take that ball away. We finally got it. It's tolling. It's a bit end to end. We really can't afford to be this far upfield. Bustamante. <laughs> How good was that slide challenge? Ah, Sanders. I worry. I really worry for the last 30 minutes of this game because they're running us a bit too close for comfort already little chip by Steinbeck he's Ellis on side I think he was there's Socrates Alves to make it 2-0 for Stockport we need this lead we need a big lead for the last 30 minutes because I know that we're going to be holding on big time here can't really blame much on Ellis that time around because the goalkeeper came out so quickly so swiftly but I do think he needs a goal this episode just to keep him going. Make sure the media doesn't get into his head about any particular drought. Greenwood's got so much time here. That is the kind of problem we face. It's Pegararo and Ellis. He's onside, right? Take your time here. Finesse it under the keeper. Oh my goodness. Damien Ellis, you really need to sort yourself out, Chief. He's basically like playing with two defenders. 
Although Steinbeck did well there. £31.5 million pounds well spent. Marcus Toland helping out the attack. There's another big chance here. Surely now, Damian Ellis. There we go. Good lad. No drought here. Damian Ellis on the score sheet. A roll reversal, to be honest, because much of this season we've seen Ellis assist Pegararo. This time the other way around. See it out, see it out. You don't need to touch it. That is half time i don't know if a two gold cushions enough oh my goodness look at buster manze he has chucked himself around the place to be honest today here comes dude up damian ellis that's a smash oh i thought that was gonna creep into the bottom corner as much as it is eye war and it is really fun to see the constant pressure work oh brilliant by victor Papitska. miranda with the power shot Game set match with his first Premier League goal. Big Victor Papitska has been fabulous. Absolutely fabulous today. Papitska, Juicy John loving life at central midfield. Oh my, oh my God, what a goal. Oh my God, what a goal. Wow, we've turned it on today. Juicy John. Rhythm is a dancer. Juicy John's the answer. Let me sniff that ginger hair. That is fantastic. Ball control pass. One, two, three. And it's five for Stockport. Man, we've got lucky today. And also sprinkling a quality here and there. The line's pretty good here, even though Sanders can't really move anymore. Sumi tries to go in for the sliding challenge. That doesn't work. Oh, yeah. Typical marking job from Jackson Chan. Away it goes. Uh, yeah, that's the kind of look that we've got today. That's full time. That could have been a whole different ball game. Super fun, super stressful. I can see why the pressing game is loved by many of the Youth Squad Legends fans. Because it is absolutely bonkers. All right, next episode, we'll start off with the Carabao Cup tie away against Stoke City. Slightly interesting. Backup players will enjoy that one, I am sure. Fed say that the sliders have been a resounding success. And that's what it's all about. That's what makes the five hours of testing yesterday all worth it. This has been Cutsy. Thank you ever so much for watching this episode of Youth Squad Legends. If you've enjoyed it, then please give the video a like. If you're not subscribed around here yet, then press the red box down below and hit the bell icon for mobile notifications. Big thanks to everybody on the right hand side supporting me financially on Patreon. You can too with the link down in the description box. See you next time, guys. Bye bye.